this video is going to be a little bit different as I need your help as the audience member to decide on what is the best and most pleasing to watch video stabilization mode on this DJI Osmo Action 3 camera and especially when it's mounted to a chin mount on my helmet like this. So I'll go through all the stabilization modes and you can vote below with a comment on what you find the most pleasing to watch. And maybe if you use the same camera, you will get some help deciding your own settings with this video. So let's get into it. First, I want to show you the differences in field of view, because the more you stabilize, the more you're going to crop in the video. Of course, it's nice to have all that information in the one video. But then again, sometimes it's pretty jarring to watch videos that are too wide. So all of these have their own unique drawbacks. But let's try to find one that pleases most of us. That's a minute in in the video. So let's dive into the test videos themselves.
it's very subjective on what looks good and what looks bad so i'm really hoping that you put in your effort and put in the comments what's your favorite field of view or if you have multiple and do you think that we actually need uh, 60 fps or is it okay to shoot 30 fps so i hope this gives you a good idea on what to use on your videos and i hope i get ideas from this as well so i am all sweaty now <sighs> it's getting too hot for this so yeah there you go all four options with 30 and 60 fps cast your vote below if you like something instead of the other or if you have multiple favorites are you gonna shoot your videos in 30 fps or 60 fps going forward now i hope we all learn something from this see you on the next videos and i'm so sweaty that i hopefully deserve the thumbs up and a subscribe from you as well <laughs> see you on the next videos bye